and today we're presenting a flag that a lot of people have been requesting. The Philippines! And it's going to come together from this messed up Play-Doh ball. Okay, it's time for the flag of the Philippines. Last time in our Flags of the World series, we examined the blue and gold flag of Sweden. Today we move back to the center of the globe. To a beautiful and massive archipelago in the Pacific. The Philippines. Time for Philippine fun facts. Number one. Number of islands in the Philippines. Over 7,500. Whoa. Number two. The Philippines are the number one supplier of coconuts. They ship about 20 million tons of coconuts a year. I can't even imagine how many coconuts that is. Well, the Great Pyramid of Egypt is only 6 million tons. Think about how big a 20 million ton pyramid of coconuts would be. Number three, Filipinos love to text. The Philippines are the texting capital of the world. They send more text messages than the United States and Europe combined. Over 150 billion a year. Number four, the Philippine eagle is the largest eagle in the world. It's the country's national bird. And it's also called the monkey eating eagle. Cause sometimes it eats monkeys. Um, why is that one eagle looking at us so funny? We're not monkeys, Mr. Eagle. Let's get back to the flag. The first flag was made by two women and one seven-year-old girl. I'm almost seven. I don't even know how to sew. It was first flown in 1898 during the Philippine Revolution against Spain. The flag of the Philippines is loaded with symbolism. The Presidential Museum and Library even has a flowchart to explain what it all means. We're better than a flowchart, Gabrielle. Let's keep this simple. Okay, the flag has a blue stripe on the top half. It represents peace, truth, and justice. I can get behind all that. Me too. The bottom half has a red stripe, which stands for patriotism and valor. What does valor mean? It means great courage in the face of danger. It honors those that fought for their country. Now on the hoist side of the flag, there's a white equilateral triangle. Equilateral? An equilateral triangle is a triangle that has sides all the same length. I knew that. I was just testing you, Gabrielle. Well, then you also know what the triangle symbolizes. Um, equality? Hmm, right. The use of the triangle also refers to a secret revolutionary movement connected to the Freemasons. This sounds like a conspiracy theory. Welcome to the internet, Elise. But the history seems to be true on this one. What's this? A star is going at each of the triangle's points. Each star stands for one of the major island groups. Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao. The Philippines is so big. In the center of the triangle, there's a golden sun. It symbolizes unity and freedom. Each ray represents a province that helped in the 1896 revolution. And there it is, the flag of the Philippines. One more thing, Elise. What's that? In the Philippines, if you hang the flag upside down with the red side on top, that indicates a state of war. Oh, wow. I hope they never have to turn their flag upside down. 
Me too. 7,500 items. So it's like a bunch of islands just like... This sounds like a conspiracy theory. Thanks everybody, bye bye! The most important piece in our puzzle is you. Be sure to like. Tell us what you think. And share us with your friends. And of course, subscribe.